and i welcome to all the guests for the today's virtual tour to the sri lanka pilot for the today's flight is manbir kaur along with the crew pilot muskan goel and janipin divya so i hope you all are excited right so over to you manbir kaur thank you muskan hello guests how are you doing today good okay excellent great so we are going to visit sri lanka today so can you tell me where does this country lies on the world map yes uh, sri lanka lies somewhere in the indian ocean and is a island country and a neighboring country to india and maldives wow great okay so as you can see the map as well so the sri lanka is actually a pearl shaped island nation in the south asia so we'll explore more about this place so before this country called as sri lanka it was named as ceylon did you know about this so formally this country was called as ceylon and officially the democratic socialist uh, republic of sri lanka is an island country in the south asia so it is situated as mentioned by anhan in the indian ocean southwest of bay of bengal and southeast of the arabian sea so while being separated from the indian subcontinent by the gulf of manar and the spark strait so talking about the population of sri lanka so it's 22.07 million as per of 2021 okay so can you tell me the capital colombo yes colombo city executive and judicial capital of sri lanka so it is situated on the west coast of the island just south of the kalani river now talking about the languages spoken at this country so the languages of sri lanka are sinhala tamil and english so sinhala is being majorly spoken at this place and tamil usually spoken by the muslim as well as an ethnic group now talking about the flag so as you can see so can you tell me the colors of the flag the colors of the flag are maroon yellow black black of the outlines green and orange okay so it's not maroon actually due to the color contrast it is appearing Abhi. like that but it's red, red. yes red. abhi hmm, this this flag looks um I mean this flag uh, I confuse it with Zimbabwe sometimes. Okay. Yeah. It is similar but the Zimbabwe has a bird and this has a lion. Right. A lion with a sword. Correct. And even they have four bowies. 1 2 3 and 4 these bowies. all right so talking about the currency here you can see the few coins as well as the note so the sri lankan rupee is the currency of sri lanka and it is symbolized as slr so if i convert it to the indian rupee so 1 indian rupee is equal to 2.69 sri lankan rupee so this means it is a more yeah but it's only 1 rupee difference now yeah of so course now it, this is very nice then i can visit that okay so now coming up with the national symbols so talking about the national anthem it's sri lanka mata and the national flower of sri lanka is blue water lily So here you can see in the first image the national flower. Then coming up to the national tree, yes, Abhi. I'm seeing the national bird, Sri Lankan jungle fowl. Yes. I've actually seen a 
I've actually seen an Indian jungle fowl, you know. Okay. All right. And talking about the national tree, so it's in an iron wood. So moving towards two more national symbols, here you can see the national butterfly. Can you tell me the national butterfly? The national uh, butterfly wing, the Lankan bird wing. Yeah. <laughs> national butterfly is funny. Yeah, they do have <laughs> national butterfly. Yeah. And they have national gemstone as well, blue sapphire. The national sport of this country is volleyball. And talking about the national animal. So I'll show you one amazing video on that as well. So Sri Lankan elephant and the lion. These are the na national animals. Okay, so now moving towards the government. So the government of Sri Lanka is a semi-presidential -pre system determined by the Sri Lankan constitution. So here you can see the image, the president of Sri Lanka, Gotabaya Raja Paksa. He is the president. Now, the culture. The culture of Sri Lanka mixes modern elements with traditional aspects. Yes, Arika. Arika, do you want to say something? Actually, the screen was paused, so I could not see the current. You want to see the currency slide? Currency. Okay, so I'll play it again for you. So this slide you are talking about? Hello. Yes, Arika. Hello. Hmm? Arika, could you please rejoin? I think there is some network issue at your end. Mama, I can I can still not see it. Okay, please rejoin. I, I, I guess there is some network issue. Kindly rejoin. Okay. So as we were talking about the culture, so Sri Lanka cul culture has long been influenced by the heritage of Buddhism, which is passed from India only. And the religion's legacy is particularly strong in Sri Lanka southern and the central regions. Okay, so coming up to the, everyone's favorite part, cuisine. So Sri Lankan cuisine is known for its particular combinations of herbs, spices, fish, vegetables, rices, and fruits. So if you visit this place, yes, Abhi? Only the dosa on the, the last one, um, the last one on the, the dosa-like thing. Only yeah. that, that looks yeah, appetizing. Kale, I think that, that that's the only thing that looks appetizing to me. Okay. okay. Inside, I, I can see one boiled omelette with the salt and pepper. Yes. Which I love. Okay, that's great. Even All the right. tar fish curry, I love it. Okay. So they usually have salt fish curry. Would you like to try that? Yeah. They eat sore fish curry. Oh. Yeah. Along with that, they have other dishes as well, such as dal curry, which is similar to the Indian dal curry. And even they have I egg nan. I will try that once if I go. Okay. Yeah, you can give a try to it. And I'm writing it so once I grow up, then I will visit all the 30 countries. Okay, that's superb. 29 actually. India, I visited now. Almost. Okay. All right. So, I'll take you to the, some of the famous places you can visit if you go to Sri Lanka. Okay. So, coming up to the most favorite and the tourist spot of Sri Lanka, the Nuvara area. 
So this place is covered with the lush greenery. So even I'll show one video as well. Okay. So there is one more amazing place, the ancient ruins. So um, what was the um before one, the first one? Are you talking about this? Yeah. So what do you want to ask? Yeah. I asked that what it was a name. Okay, so this is actually the hill station in Navara. Oh so, yeah. So this place is covered with so many of the trees and the mountains. So if you visit this place, you can experience the stunning views of the surrounding. And here you can see this is the pea plantation farming. Yeah, I saw that. Yeah. And there, there are so many waterfalls and the dramatic mountains. And uh, even uh, you can have a ride on a train as well. And you can go for the trekking. Yeah, I know? love trekking, you know. Oh, great. And do you know this is the one of the safest place you can visit during COVID as well? Really? Yes. So, means this country has a good government. Yeah. And the people do listen. Yes. In India also, the government is good, but the people don't listen. Yeah. We can say that. Okay. So coming up to the next, so the next in the list is again the city that is popular for the temples and this has to be one of the best places to visit in Sri Lanka and if you visit this place you can easily spend your day imagining the ancient city life at the ruins of Polona Rua, the well-preserved and full of archaeological treasures with hundreds of ancient structures like tombs, temples, statues and stupas. So it is quite difficult to not to be amazed by the ruins here because this place has so many ancient structures. Okay, so the place which is also the UNESCO World Heritage Site. So can you tell me the place? Adams Peak. Yes. Adams Peak. So this is also Adam. one of the tourist places. From that, I remember one drink also, Kadam. Okay. And this is the, one of the most beautiful places as well in the Sri Lanka. So you can climb the slopes at the night to watch the breathtaking sunrise at dawn. Wow. And, yeah. From now, now only it's a breathtaking view. <laughs> Okay, so another religious tourist place in Sri Lanka. So this place is also called the City of the Temples in Sri Lanka. And the one of the best Sri Lankan attractions for the spiritual retreat. So the most visited temples of all in this place are the Temple of Nalu, uh, Nalu Kovil. So this is the actually historical architectures. Okay, so coming up to the airline path. So the Sri Lankan is the flag carrier airlines of Sri, uh, Sri Lanka, Sri Lankan Airlines. So this country has few more other airlines. So one is Cinnamon Air. The other is Heli Tours. Yeah, it looks more like a helicopter than a plane. Yeah, yeah, they, these are helicopters. Oh, so they even have helicopters. Then the next time this gets here. Very funny okay. name. So that was all about. Oh my. I've just finished the thing. Which I wanted to visit. That country only, the page is almost full now. Okay, so do you enjoy? Yes. So now I have a very yes. beautiful video for you all. <gasps> Are you excited? Yes. Okay, okay. So I request everyone to mute their mics and enjoy this video.
by listening by listening by listening to all those things that wildlife. make wildlife thing fun like blue like elephants coming out of nowhere because i like elephants and this thing like blue whales crashing into the water <laughs> i, I love, love, love whales i love whales me too oh, well i'm really <laughs> glad you enjoyed and, the tour and and, and, and what are the wildlife it's, it's 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 full of it's full of that's why i was not uh, um, i was not taking the uh, uh, national park so i would write it down in the full uh, full details that's why i i'm writing yeah. that on another page that yala okay. national park is one place i shall visit if because same if, over if here i want to see some very very like interesting animals I'm going to go there some some time yeah. with the corona ends. See, the animals which are some unique ones. Yeah, so you must visit this place because it is really beautiful. Okay, so I hope you all enjoy today's tour, right? Yes. Okay. Excellent. So on Monday we will be visiting Thailand. Thailand. Yes, so I, I have a task for you. Asian country now. Yeah. So Hi. I have a task for you all. Yep. Yes. So you have to search about some amazing facts of this country. Facts. Yes, facts of Thailand. Okay. All right. Okay. Oh, can so, I draw the flag of it? Yeah, sure. You can draw the flag as well. Okay, ma'am. All right. So I hope you all enjoy today's tour. So stay excited for our Monday's tour to the Thailand. So we will meet yes, you at the same time, and we'll explore Thailand. So bye, everyone. Have a good day. Bye, ma'am.